Are you looking for the 5 best gaming laptops under $1,500 of 2021? In this video we will look at some of the top best gaming monitors on the market. Before we get started with our video we have included links in the description for each product mentioned so make sure you check those out to see which is in your budget range. Starting at number 5. Acer Predator Helios 300 RTX 3060. The Helios 300 is the ideal laptop if you enjoy high-octane gameplay. It's a machine filled to the brim with plenty of top-tier components all aimed at the same goal, pure gaming glory. At the helm of Helios is the high-speed display. The color-rich IPS screen is 15.6 and has a 144Hz refresh rate with a 3 millisecond overdrive response time. With a higher refresh rate, the frame rate will be smooth with no tearing as long as you keep that frame rate high. A high frame rate requires high performing hardware, which thankfully there is plenty of. At the top of that list is the latest 6 core 12 thread 10th gen Intel Core i7 mobile processor and GeForce RTX design. At number 4. MSI GL65 Leopard RTX 2070. The MSI GL65 is the first gaming laptop that I've tested with NVIDIA's new high wattage 2070 graphics card. The lid is a matte black metal, and the bottom is plastic. Overall build quality is fair, and there are no sharp corners or edges anywhere. The GL65 is on the thicker side for a gaming laptop with this hardware inside. There's an MSI logo in the center of the lid that gets lit up from the screen's backlight. However, the width and depth are reasonable for a 15-inch machine. The smaller footprint allows for 7.5mm screen bezels on the sides. The 15.6, 1080p, 144HZ screen has a matte finish and uses Optimus, which cannot be disabled. At number 3. Omen 17 RTX 2070. HP is still going strong with its 2020 Omen 17 gaming laptop. It comes with the Intel 10th generation Core i7, NVIDIA RTX 2070 graphics card, 16GB of RAM, and 512GB C and M SSD. It's quite upgradable, and the bottom is easy to take off, unlike some of HP's Spectre laptops. It has a large 17.3 inches Full HD IPS display with a refresh rate of 144Hz. The display covers 100% of sRGB, 65% of above RGB, and has a contrast ratio of 1385, 1. HP has improved the fans on this laptop. They made fans a bit longer to have more air volume, and the vents are also bigger to allow more air to pass through. It has vents on three sides and intakes air from the bottom. At number 2. Razer Blade 15 Base RTX 2060. The Razer Blade 15 comes in two editions, the Base and the Advanced. The Base version is cheaper, and the Advanced version is quite expensive. But the Base edition doesn't mean it's a weak product. Nothing much has changed from the previous version. It has the same decent looking design with a Razer logo on the lid. The aluminum unibody design is quite sturdy with an electrochemical finish that prevents minor scratches. Overall, it's very compact and classy looking. On the left, from the back, we have a charging port, gigabit ethernet, USB 3.2, USB-C, and 3.5mm audio port. On the right from the back, we have a Kensington lock, HDMI 2.0, 2 USB 3.2, and Thunderbolt. There are no exhaust vents on either side. At number 1. Dell G7 4K OLED RTX 2070 MQ. On paper, Dell has done a great job delivering one of the best gaming laptops for gamers and content creators. But is it really good enough? Let's find out. Looking at the design, it has a nice build quality with a metal finish. I didn't like the hinge design because it is known to break down sooner than traditional design. It comes with an Intel Core i7 10750H with 16GB of DDR4 RAM and NVIDIA RTX 2070 MQ with 8GB of VRAM. This Dell G7 variant has a 15.6-inch, 4K OLED, 60Hz screen. A low refresh rate might not be acceptable for gamers who play online competitive games. But if you are okay with a 60Hz screen, it has the best display you can get on a gaming laptop.